Today, I'm going to show you some helpful confirmation tips for show. I will start off by showing you the technique I used for gathering the show lead. I can quickly gather the show lead by making loops in the palm of my hand. Let's see that again. The show lead is loose. I gather it up by making loops as if a figure eight and tucking it in to the palm of my hand. What position should you hold the show lead? You should hold the show lead between your hip and waist. It's a good idea to learn what stacking pose is appropriate for your dog in practice. First, I will use a large piece of bait as an attention getter. When I practice stacking, I will use subtle cues such as a gentle tug on the show lead or placement on my hands. Then I'll get his attention and give him a treat. I will also use a marker such as a thumbs up to let him know he did a great job. It's always a good idea to practice different poses to find out which poses shows off your dog's best attributes. I will now demonstrate how I practice the down and back. When I do the down and back, I always make sure the dog stays in line with the judge. I then do a courtesy turn. Let's see that again. I do a courtesy turn, making sure my dog lines up with the judge coming back. I then quickly turn, get his attention, and have him stack square. I then give the marker a thumbs up to let him know he did a great job. At the end of each lesson, I always remember to give a release word in praise. It's always a good idea to give your dog a cue word or marker so he knows he's all done for today. Here, I clap my hands and then I give the release word, all done! With lots of fun and practice, you can have great success, just like we did at our last show.